Hello, SK and RMC. My name's the Internet. And w it, wait, Th did I just screw that up? Yeah. Uh, uh take two. Hello, Internet. My name is Sonic at six one nine, and that is RMC digging over there. And welcome back to another episode of Minecraft. Today's episode, me and RMC are going to for an epic quest of slime. We need some slime balls so I can get started on some some cool projects with redstone and pistons, but I am lacking slime. So we went caving. Uh, not only are we going on an ore run to get different materials like iron and redstone and diamonds and stuff like that, but we're also keeping an eye out for slime. Uh, the room that I built specifically for slime has not worked I I don't know if they'll spawn in a man-made man -made room or anything I don't I don't know the conditions for it but so we just took our chances and we're just doing some random mining here keeping our eye out for caves and hopefully our ears out for slime so far we've been mining for a little bit haven't found any hopefully we'll find some soon and hopefully he's a big guy uh, there is a duplication glitch I know we may have to do because slime are so rare in this game or at least in this version of Minecraft so uh, keep you guys updated if we find anything anything interesting or if one of us dies See you guys in a few minutes. I'm going to cross the abandoned mine shaft here. So we're going to explore this a little bit. And see what lies in store for us here. Either it's going to be great treasure and victory or lots and lots of death due to those annoying cave spiders. We'll find out. Took some of this iron. Okay. Excuse me. Give me away, water. But uh, I guess a quick update to let you guys in. Still haven't found any slime yet. None at all. I know the PC version, there's slime chunks and all that. And they spawn at certain levels. I don't know if that exists even in the console version, if they just spawn randomly or not. If you if any of you guys know, please Please inform us. Otherwise, we'll probably be looking forever here. Oh, I thought I saw a chest. That's a dead end. Uh, this way. This goes up. I found more of the shaft, RMC. I found a chest. What's in chest number one? Some coal, some melon seeds, some pumpkin seeds, and one diamond. All right. Get up there. Well, we have one diamond. Moving up in life. <laughs> okay. Melon seeds. Yeah, I just that was the chest I just uh raided. Some dumb stuff in it. That's what I just did. Hey, another chest. All oh, right. Uh-oh. Normally sign of cobwebs, there's usually that spawner nearby. Lots of cobwebs. Yeah. Anyways, let's see what's in this chest. Some bread. Some more mail or pumpkin seeds, more iron, and more coal. All right. Speaking of iron, some more iron right here. Some more iron. Come on, there's a whole other section over here. Oh, hello, zombie. Get out of here. Stupid cobwebs. Oh, hi there.
Uh, guys, we're, we're just having terrible luck here with the slime as a whole. Let's not go down that way just yet. That's another hole. Probably the same hole. Uh, there's more of this, the uh, mine shaft over here. A rope. Oh. You know what? I forgot. I gotta keep put the torches on the right so I know which way to go to get out of here. I haven't been doing that. You probably shouldn't follow that now. Huh? So you probably shouldn't follow that now. I've been placing them all over. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Oh, There's a hole. Oh yeah, I probably saw that big hole. There's a zombie. My shaft. Get out of here. Do I see a chest? Now? I found a whole another section over here, RMC. Like it goes on forever and ever and ever and there's no escaping Nope, oh, dead end never mind I lied <laughs> yep. oh still no slime Bummer. All right, I guess I guess we'll just keep mining, and uh, we'll bring you guys back for anything interesting. If we run across any more cave, or if we run across any cave spiders, or if one of us dies, or we find slime, and then we'll go home. If not, then we'll just probably head on back and do something else. So, see you guys in a little bit again. Are you close to me, RMC? I mean, you were just right there. Yep. Right. I right, pick up my stuff. Oh, fudge. Pick up my stuff, stick it all in the inner chest, and come on home. Welcome back. We got back from our little mining slime finding thing. Unfortunately, we didn't find any slime, but at the same time, we came back with a whole bunch of goodies. There it's, is a lot of coal. I already have an overflow chest of coal. And with a fortunate three, th that chest is going to be full. I'm going to probably have to get another overflow chest. But we came back with a total of 12 diamonds, 3 emeralds, I think 40 redstone, and this is a stack and a half of coal. Plus one lapis. So. Uh... Hopefully, we soon we can find some slime because there's just I I like to do a lot with redstone, but I need some sticky pistons and all that. A new update for some odd reason hasn't come out for the PS4 just yet in North America, and so that's that's kind of a downer. I mean, I've been really wanting to get a horse. And fight the wither and all that, get get beacons, and get the redstone blocks, coal blocks, and all that goodies, all all those goodies. But fortunately, it hasn't come out just yet. I'm gonna need an overflow chest of of redstone. My goodness, I'm already at three stacks. So, uh, that's. On that note, that's that's a bummer kind of note though, but on that note, look at all the goodies we have. This is it amazing? RMC, are, are, are you messing with the wildlife again? I'm sniping the wildlife. Sniping the wildlife. Well, I also do want to apologize to you guys that uh, for the lack of videos for the past week or so, uh, I think I've already mentioned this in the Skyblock episode. 
uh, PSN was down uh, and then Christmas and the New Year's and all that so me and RMC are getting back into the groove of things uh, I should have another episode of, of Battle Lady it's either out or coming out soon depending on which one I can edit the quickest and get it out are you being followed by something? What? A 360 no scope, a creeper. <laughs> okay, you noob. This is all uh, cool. Anyways, uh, well, let's go find something to do once I'm finished with all of this coal. To ride a minecart. Anyways, well, it's not my fault you didn't put it right. <laughs> I did put it right, you just don't know how to flick a switch. But I'm gonna hey. show you how to flick a switch when I come back to the house. Whoa, 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 hey, wrong camera, wrong camera, right? Calm down. I lost my pickaxe during that mining expedition. Now, luckily, I've kept Silk Touch, but I lost my work pickaxe, which was the efficiency 3 and unbreaking 3. So, that's what I'm doing here. I have 30 levels. And uh, afterwards, we're going to do some terraforming here. Uh, yes. Alright, hopefully we get a good look of the draw. And bam. I don't know, I'm not, I'm not confident with that one. What about this one? Yep, still not confident with that one. What about this one? It's just, whoops. That's probably going to sound really weird. Um... Nope, same, same, same thing. I don't, I don't know. I, I really hope I get a good pick, but I don't want one that's too good where I don't want to use it too much. I just need an efficiency and unbreaking and whatever else is attached to it. That's just fine. But I mostly need efficiency and unbreaking. Oh, if it's just efficiency or just unbreaking, I'm gonna be so angry. Efficiency 4 and Unbreaking 3. Yes, that is exactly what I was looking for. That was exactly what I was looking for. Okay. Let me go grab my shovel. That was the only thing I forgot to grab. But anyways, for the rest of the episode, I'm going to spruce up a little bit of the outside, connect some paths, light up the places, get rid of some of the torches out there. Where's my shovel? There's my shovel. Oh, I gotta repair my shovel. Screw I'll just make an iron one. And just to make the outside look a little bit better. And yeah, iron, iron, iron. I need iron. Front chest. We just did that so uh, we'd get the achievement for the rails. We have all the achievements there? now. And let's go do some terraforming. Yeah, we have to wait until we get the new ones. Alright, so he's talking to himself. You weirdo. Anyways, what I want to do is uh, the stone brick path here. I want to connect it to everywhere that we usually go to. So from here to probably the village slash piggy track over there. From here to the base of his uh, RMC's tree house thing, and then connect it up with this, and then from here we we'll have paths connecting out to the bridge that goes to the cemetery. A uh, small little path that connects the the barn, and then that's about it. And then we'll probably make the place look a little bit more spiffy, look a little bit more organized. And yeah, that should be that should be good. I don't want the path too straight like this. So, up oh, RMC's entered the end. And yeah, no. anyways. So what I mostly want is a three-wide path. That should be good enough. And then from there, it should branch off between this from here to God, get that one so like for instance if we want to go to the fishing shack which we really haven't used 
I'd probably have like a one way path. No, it's three way. Three way path like that. Three wide path. And then we'll get some of the stone brick here laid down. And then every so often, um, I have redstone lamps on me. I should probably just use glowstone. It would be a little bit easier to hide the lever. I don't know. We'll see. Oh man, I'm gonna love this pick. Let's put it like that, like that. And so we have torches here everywhere. So let's get rid of some of these torches. Make it a little dark and see how much of these redstone lamps will actually light up the path here. And hopefully that will make it look better than just having a whole bunch of torches scattered everywhere. Alright. And I brought some fences and some cobblestone walls to see which one will look better in comparison. So, for instance, we'll have one here. They are a better too stupid. Uh... How about... Whoops. Four high. Break, 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 break. And I missed. Completely missed. There we go. I have some dirt. Awesome. Just jump up to here. Place this down. Get my levers. And whoops. Bam. So every so often we'll have uh a light like that. So I'm gonna every let's see one two. Let's have another one here. Like that, like that, and then up to here. Place the lamp, lever, flick, and down. Oh. All right. Now I'm gonna try the cobblestone walls. So right here. There, two, three, two, three. All right, MC. Whenever you come back, let me know what you think of these. Right. These are simple, but we could probably come up with uh, another idea, another design for them. Oop. Yeah, those look just kind of too plain. Uh, what happens if I was to do... Let's try this. Give me that back. Let's make this go up one more. And then over. Like that. Hang down. And then on this side, have a lever. Now that's that's kind of too low. I don't think. That. You know what? I'm gonna go grab some glowstone. So with this, it come up like this. Get out of here, fence. I'll make this come up one more, and then over like that. And then we can hang this down. Yeah, I think I like that better. I need to see if I can get another looting book. Another looting sword? No book. Oh, if book. I can get looting on book, then I can add it to my sword. Ooh, crap. <laughs> this pickaxe. Alright, so let's try this again with the cobblestone wall. So, what do we do? Go like five high. Yeah, one more. Five and then hang over. No. Which I don't even think we need to make it hang over. We can just place it. Let's yeah, we don't even need to make it hang over. We'll just connect automatically. Shouldn't it? No? Huh. I gotta go get my silk touch. I'm so unprepared for this. Um, here, let me do the rest of this off camera because I'm pretty sure you guys don't want to sit through 
me just doing the rest of that, but any other design I would do, I'll do it on camera. Alright, so let me go put up the rest of the path and we'll try out the different lights. Okay, I finished the path, uh, but I still gotta put in the, the rest of the lights. I kinda ran out of spruce wood. I forgot to show a little earlier, I did this. Remember how I had columns here with stone stairs going across? The stone brick stairs going across? I didn't look, really look right, so I just decided to add porches. I think these look a whole lot better. I might need to move this one to here to extend it just a bit. But uh, in here I have leaves, some glowstone behind it, so it kind of lights up. It doesn't really come all the way down here, but those are just to, to light up there, make it a little more brighter. But uh, I forgot to show this earlier. I did this off camera before I even started recording. Okie dokie, everybody. Uh, I'm going to show you the path of what I've created here so far. And then I'm going to have to end the episode. So, I have the path connecting from my house. And then it branches off here to go to the Kinkles Cake Shop. And then Brat... Bra uh, oh, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Comes here. <laughs> Comes here. Goes to the fishing shack. Breaks off again. Goes to RMC's house. I kind of made his path a little wider because to me, the tree just kind of looks weird. Just two here one path here so I just kind of made it even so it was centered um and then from there it just continues here and abruptly stops here though but connects to the fountain here to go to the cemetery or at least a bridge to the cemetery and then from here it kind of does a weird curve but I think that looks kind of cool to connect to the barn and as you can see I have lights spread out every so often I ran out of spruce wood so I can't continue to make them, but these are these are a lot easier to make than the than the fences and then putting the the glowstone on top. Uh if you're wondering how I know I or how I'm powering these. Oh, bad example. <laughs> oh man, I I fell through. This I'm a terrible let's play. I I'm still beginning, so please please forgive me. But anyways, I have a lever here which powers the spruce wood there and then powers that let me put that back and get out of this cave here and because this is powered redstone can redstone signals due to levers buttons or anything can travel through one block and power on anything that's touching it so I can put one there one there one there one there but I cannot put one off of that or off of this one it can only travel through one block and that's it. And one block past it. Oh, I'm see there. So, that's how I got that set out. And I think I already said that. I, I, I'm not sure. I don't remember. So I'm going to say it again. If I've already said it, I may not have. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm, I'm a little tired here. It's, uh, it's a little late for me in RMC. So... With these, I have these spaced out just enough so that mobs don't spawn. They are anything that's below light level 8, 8 and below, mobs can spawn. So these are spaced out just enough so that the light level here and in between are not 8, so nothing should spawn near or on the path. But maybe something may spawn here when it's a little darker, but at least on the path, they shouldn't spawn. Not at all. So thank you all for watching I am out of time uh, I hope you guys like this and please leave a comment down below of what you think of this if it if my let's plays are stupid or or suck or if they can be improved then please leave a comment and any feedback is helpful just please don't be too rude just just because you can let me know uh, if, if there's anything I can improve on in this and please also leave a comment of what you th of what else should we do in this world uh, I'm I mean, we're we're doing some pretty cool things here. So let me let me know what you guys think. If you like it, if you don't, and w what else we should do. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you all had a great time, and have a nice day. Bye bye. I am weird. That's what makes me different from the world. I say screw.